What's up, y'all? What's up? What's up? How you doing? Nerd of sounds out there. I got kids. Yeah, I know it's a little late there. They kicking in with they not not right now. I watch them Shrek and stuff, so. <laughs> How y'all doing? How y'all doing, Scorpios? What's going on with you? Let's see what's popping for the Scorpios the next week. Dang, yo. So I got this new deck. So awesome. Can't wait to use it. Still reading up on the cards and everything. But I'm definitely going to use them, break them in tomorrow, more likely. But I know, man. Y'all doing good, chilling. We got snow here up north. Not a lot, but. So I can't complain. A lot less than what we usually do. Shuffle. I was meditating on your energy. Fuel, like energized, passionate, which definitely describes Scorpio down to the T. So what's going on? You know, getting some new. I mean, this year it does have three tens in it. Twenty nineteen. Is a year of transformations, and yeah, the energy was like already <laughs> out there before the uh, start of the new year. So now it's really it's taking off, huh? Starting new ventures, new relationships. Those ones come out. Let's go ahead and open someone out. Let's see. Wash away your burdens. Love that you are different. So with all these new ventures, and like, you know, I might be holding on to a couple burdens, a couple past things, past plights, hurts, pains, traumas, you know, but I feel like it is a passing energy and it's nothing that's actually, you know, staying. Know your fears towards the burdens. Know your fears came out. See another, and that's 20. 10, that's completion. Love that you are different. See, <laughs> know your power. Yeah, not a coincidence that that came on out. But love that you are different. Love that, you know, your unique gift is the reason that you're here. You're, uh, your differences that might have caused you burdens, might have caused you pain, you know. Um, we're really, I'm noticing um, a lot of us, we're having to dive deep into our past, like childhood when we were growing up, things of that nature, you know, um, experiences with our parents and, you know, even it's going as far back the stories that our parents used to tell us with their parents and figuring out what's, you know, the pattern that, you know, kind of passed down a form of a generational curse. But um, a lot of times, you know, when we're our most authentic selves, when we are children, you know, the good and the bad qualities, because especially toddlers, you know, toddlers want what they want. That's when their ego is pretty much the only thing and, <laughs> they want what they want. And, you know, as parents, you know, we have to go in there and, okay, well, you can't do this. You need patience. You can't just cut in front of everybody because you want to be first. You know, you got to stand in line. It's only right. And it's, you know, some stuff, some stuff, you know, is affected that, let's say you had, A crystal collection, you know, when you were little, that's not, you know, people are like, what's that? You know, you go get a Sega. But, you know, people used to make fun of you and things like that. For, 
things of that nature. And then now, you know, with terror and everything else, it turned out to be a great help, you know, as well as like an eyesight into like, oh, this is like something I've been into since I was younger, you know, it did make me different. And yeah, people made fun of me for it. I'm digging from a personal experience because, you know, that happened to me. But, you know, love that you are different. Love the things. What makes you you is the fact that you be to your own drum. And don't let anybody, you know, make you feel any less than that. And the fact that show that you care is right underneath it. Got all these cards. Really, all these cards. Show that you care is right underneath it. Um, you know, love yourself. Care about yourself. Love the fact that you are special and your uh, values, your opinions, your thoughts are valued. Somebody out there can use them. Who knows? You might have been through something that nobody else has been through or can relate to it in the way that you can. And by, you know, helping and sharing it with others, you know, and not necessarily worry about, you know, what happened before in the past where you share something probably got, you know, made fun of, or um, people thought you were crazy or whatever the case may have been. It made you feel a sense of dis-ease. You know, don't put that, wash those burdens away. You know, your fear is behind it. Like, okay, it's a fear of, you know, not, belonging in a sense but you know go ahead go for it gotta get to gotta get through the nose to get to the yeses and this is i'm seeing this for career and relationships as well uh make the sacrifice it's next with know your power Know that you are powerful. Your passions are powerful. They run deep. Um, with being a Scorpio, your passions is basically what uh, helps guide and runs pretty much everything. It's pretty much the heartbeat of a Scorpio to know, you know, the mysterious sides of things and be very passionate. And look at this card. Look at all those emotions. By that water. Well, I mean, it's fire, but passions, people. Okay, you guys get it. But, you know, all those emotions, you know, make the sacrifice. Don't hold your emotions in about whatever this may be. If this is a love situation, you know, they love you for who you are. <laughs> Sorry, I came out right with that. They love you for who you are, you know. So love yourself for who you are and the fact that you're different. And, um, wash your burdens away. Know your fears, you know, behind uh, get into a commitment that just may very well be different. The fact that we have the eight of pentacles. So, you know, take your time. Enjoy the process. Enjoy the road leading up to that because, I mean, it. The once you get to the top, you know, that's the fun part, but that part does go by kind of quick. It's like being on a roller coaster. When you're going up, is that anticipation is the build because that was that's really what sets the tone is for it being as fun as it is is going down the hill, is going up and that setting the tone like, oh my God, oh my God, I can't believe I'm doing this. Like, this is so exciting. This is so much fun. And you're just going up like, oh, look at all the scenery. Look at all this, you know, you know, and then you get to the top and it's like, you know, so enjoy and enjoy the work in progress if it is a career you know enjoy the climb up enjoy you know the little things the little projects that you're doing the um the yeah enjoy the little projects and things of that nature that you're doing it's the little stuff the connections that you are making along the way and then you know stay balanced you got this don't worry about it you got this Share your thoughts. You got this. You don't, you know. Know your fears. Meditate. Go in. Come back out. You start. And got the Ace of Swords. You know what it is you need to do? Protect the wild and the green. Observe in silence. If you need to go inside, meditate. Go within. Figure out, okay, what it is that I need to do to be able to, you know, plan the next move. Plan accordingly what you need to do to um, get to the 
to your goal, whether it's <laughs> whether it's uh, if it is in a relationship, you know, take your time, go on dates, you know, text, phone calls, you know, get to know each other a little bit more, um, you know, listen to them as well. Ooh, clarification on protect the green and wild. Go out in nature. Well, maybe somebody works for the environment or her. So I'm seeing a lot of trees, like the environmentalist, park ranger. Queen of Wands. Something that you're passionate about. There's definitely a career as far as so I'm not sure who that's for, but yeah, with three of cups. It's definitely a career um change. Let's let two become one and then hear the Asian ones. You know, go in and uh, observe in silence, focus, and then act. So, yes, it's definitely telling Scorpios to. If this is soulmate, whether family, friend, romantic, you know, maybe this person might have caused you a little bit of this ease or. Um, Never really listen to your side of things. Seem like for if it is like the sibling, um, maybe you're like the younger sibling, and you know your older siblings kind of always, and you're like, look, I'm valid too. This matters. The Knight of Cups. You know, tell me, you know, you do have something to give, and yeah, it might take you. You know, a little bit to bring it up and share your thoughts, but you do have something valid. You know, it just takes you a little bit longer. You're very observant. You watch things. You know, you just don't act. You you watch. You sit there and gather everything that you feel like you need to gather before you do decide to uh, open your mouth and speak. Um, or you could be telling, you know, vice versa. Maybe, you know, that is what needs to happen you need to, you know, stop, you know, just reacting and worry about and thinking that something's going to happen this way. So you're just kind of reacting instead of um, actually taking time out to think about what it is that you're doing before you just act. Because it, it does play a part because at that point, you're kind of going off of emotions and you want to make sure that you are balanced in whatever the situation is, especially if it is, you know. <laughs> Well, yeah, it definitely is a love situation. And see, I was going right on into that. <laughs> Spirit, I love when they do that. Um, definitely a love situation uh, could definitely be going on here. Maybe some deceit or, you know, some secrets or you've been hurt in the past before. And, you know, you're just a, a little unsure because you do consider yourself different. You know, you're not like, you know, everybody else or this person is like everybody else. And you're kind of like, you know, you don't know about this person. You're a little sketchy. So you feel like you kind of got to sit back, watch, observe, you know, like, eh, you know, we'll see, you know, taking your time. You're hearing the age, you're hearing the age of ones, you know, you channel the spirit, Gaia, you know, your divine self, your oneness going within. But, you know, it says don't be afraid of the connection, whether it's with yourself within, you know, coming to a realization of what you need to do as far as career move or, you know, associates, friends, things of that situation or in a, um, romantic sense and as well as within yourself as well don't be afraid to harvest your power feel your emotions and um actually go towards your dreams and share your thoughts and act on them because you got the ten of cups you got the ten of cups you got the ten of cups with the four of wands see Beautiful. Yeah, definitely. Let go. Got something good coming in. Be passionate. Go forth into your calling. Definitely making some transformations. Definitely. This is beautiful, y'all. This is beautiful. I'm loving the energy that's been going around lately. I don't know what's been going on, but it's been beautiful. Of course, it's a new year, and we all on fleek, you know? It's 2019. It's 2019. Look, I'm all y'all. I remember when 
it was about to turn 2000 and people were like buying water and canned goods galore because they thought the world was literally just about to reset because the computers are all going to read zero zero and they just thought that everything people would drew money from banks and the whole like <laughs> Uh, Y2K, man. A spirit of a uh, crystal guidance. Crystal guidance. Greatly appreciate it. Ooh. Four Scorpios for the next week. Blue Lace against. Okay, it's definitely. All right, all right, all right. Just one more. Please. It's got to be this minute. Oh, no, that's. No, we, we, we're not doing that. Mm mm. See how they try to, mm-mm, 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 mm-mm. That was way too many cards. Definitely got some, yeah, y'all energy. Three, okay, we still going to that. Three, all right. Aerolite. <laughs> Crystal Cola. Who named these? That one's actually kind of cool, though. Crystal Cola. Okay, we're going to go with the blue lace. Okay, I believe y'all got this before. We'll see. All right, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Blue lace again. Look, man, I got boys. I've been playing with my boys all day, so excuse my nails. Blue lace again. Stop looking at them because I'm pointing them out. Uh, Self-expression. Blue Lace Gate connects spirit with intellect, highlighting integrity. It enhances the ability to communicate effectively what is on your mind and heart. Self-understanding. Attune to your inner being to express the fullness of who you are. Be confident when speaking in public as you have much to share. You may have been silenced, silenced in the past, repressing thoughts and feelings causes throat problems. So speak your mind gently, honestly, and clearly. You have the gift of serenity. Use it wisely. Speak Divination. Speak your heartfelt truth with integrity and confidence. Do not fear being judged. Expect news shortly and keep lines of communication open. Events unfold slowly. Return to basics and start, if, and start again if necessary. Focus your mind and open your intuition. Your life will be long and happy. Accept your sensitive side. Yeah. All the water, see? All those emotions. That... Express yourself. And that's a 10. Y'all got three 10s. Anyone you know talking about the year with three 10s? Look, it's, it's coming full circle. I mean, completions, mind, body, and soul. Like, this might be the last thing you honestly have to do before, like, whatever it is that the next lead into like you're you you've already completed a cycle you're this is the next step into the four one with actually you know pulling the door completely closed behind you as you're stepping outside that's what that's a good one that's a good one i appreciate it all right all right all right you're a light you're a light we'll go with your light 24 six see Balance, balance, take your time. No, okay, that's all connected. Your light 23 has a sedative effective on the mind, stealing it so that profound healing and conscious connection with your soul, the universal mind and higher dimension occurs. Self-understanding. You are a multi-layered soul on a course of accelerated spiritual growth. You came to Earth to share your knowledge. You have an ability to move between different dimensions to anchor new vibrations into the Earth plane. The, slow, the slowness and seeming impossibility of the task have brought disillusionment and discontent, but do not despair. Raise your own consciousness and others will follow. Divination. Recognize that you are an in integral part of humanity. Center yourself in inner peace and connect to your higher mind before making a decision. Beneficial contacts come through friends and family. It is not so much what you know as whom that counts now. 
and that includes higher beings. And wasn't it, when they do that, boy, be cohesive as I don't know what. And that, man, I love when y'all do that, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, and see, Crystal Cola, I like that one. <laughs> That's a four, too. Build a foundation, steady foundations, y'all. Yeah, see, I'm, I'm a Scorpio, too. I'm sad Scorpio cut, so we in it together, man. Self-love. So cohesive. So cohesive. Love that you are different. I, I, okay. All right. Tranquil and sustaining. Crystal Cola encourages you to remain serene and strong during change or challenge. Dis dissolving destructive emotional programming, it increases energy assimilation. Self-understanding. You have infinite capacity for forgiveness. Love yourself. If you cannot accept yourself, you cannot give love or accept the love of others. To heal your emotional black hole, connect to the universal love that is inside you. It never runs out. You can then give out then you can then give love out to the world and receive it in a never-ending flow. Divination. Forgive yourself. Accept with equanimity what you cannot change. Let go of hurt and rectify situations that can be healed. Be magnanimous. Remain impartial and speak your own truth, but recognize when to keep silent. Magical, magical rituals may keep you chained to the past. There may be past life trauma to heal around being a woman, having feminine, you know, having your feminine side, embrace the femininity. See, it wasn't it? embrace your feelings and all that. Ain't nothing wrong, especially guys. Ain't nothing wrong with embracing your emotions. Yes, men do cry. Look, here's a good song. Um, because this came to my August Elsina song cry. Not Jay Z. August Elsina. Listen to it. Great song. Um, and um. Janelle, it, no, no, ooh, okay, let me find this song real quick, sorry guys, it's, I like, I like that, but I gotta, see who sings it, great song, Janelle Monet. I like that, that's a song that I play, um, just to lift my, my mood and it just makes you feel good about yourself all the way through for uh, everything. I'll play like a snippet of it. Oh, copyright. But yes, definitely Janelle Monet. I like that. And August I've seen the song cry. Guys, get in touch with your emotions. You know, ain't nothing wrong. You know, embrace that in that does come into play. You gotta be able to embrace your thoughts with your emotions and come out to, you know, a balance, you know decision if you're either too emotional or too uh in your in your uh, head you know take time out listen to your guys meditate pray spiritual bath cleanse incense candles whatever it is that you do get in touch with yourself and you got this because ten of cups y'all ten of cups all right see y'all later oh <laughs> All the information in um, below. Um, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, uh, Facebook, Spiritual Experiences. All right, y'all. I'll let you later. <laughs> Bye.